guys, boy, Benny. So we spend a lot of time on our phones and often we are on the X app and I must read probably a thousand or more posts a day on the X platform, maybe 5,000. I'm not sure, it's a lot. I check the time per app and uh, I spend a lot of time on X. And I've never actually agreed with a post on X more than this post. This post saying that Donald Trump staring directly into the sun during the 2017 eclipse should be his presidential portrait. And I could, I mean, look at this, look, it's, it's beautiful. It's be, you feel like crying looking at the, the photo. Look at what they stole from us. Donald Trump looking directly at the sun, pointing at the sun, threatening the sun, challenging the sun and winning a staring competition with the sun. As you can see, the sun reflected off of his little blue pupils right there. That should be the presidential portrait. You should carve this into Mount Rushmore. You should find the stone where you can literally carve this directly out of stone, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. And I totally agree. And it's hilarious. It is really funny. People people actually make memes about this moment. You, of course, remember this moment, 2017? Uh, memes were made. <laughs> Oh. oh my God. <laughs> this is so. <laughs> Even the eclipse knows. Yes. Never forget what they stole from you, says Congressman Mike Collins. Never forget Trump fought the sun and won. Everybody bringing this up today, obviously, because it's Eclipse Day. We will never forget. When everybody was saying, do not look at the sun during the eclipse, and Trump literally stared directly at it. So many great photos of this moment. Melania, stunning as always, but not as uh, not as ravishing and bright as the sun, as Donald Trump is staring again directly into the sun. Return. Return to us, ladies and gentlemen. So we, we thought this was really, really funny. Okay, Donald Trump thought it was really, fun, really funny. Right? Donald Trump used this opportunity to post a meme of him uh, as the eclipse. And we'll play that for you in just a second. We wanna like highlight the fact that there are libs, however, to this very day that seethe and freak out and lose their damn minds over the fact that Donald Trump looked into the sun and the fact that Donald Trump makes memes of this. Time Magazine doesn't know what a meme is. A couple of years ago in 2017, Time Magazine said, Trump's anti-Obama eclipse meme doesn't make scientific sense. They've literally fact-checked the memes, okay? They went to the scientists and fact-checked this meme, ladies and gentlemen, this one, this meme of Donald Trump overtaking Barack Obama. Best eclipse ever. <laughs> okay. So they're deeply unfunny. They are deeply cringe, and they don't know how to laugh, these people. They don't understand what a joke is. They don't understand what a meme is. They have no joy in their life. They have nothing to live for, and they... Don't understand that the rest of America thinks Donald Trump's freaking legend and that this kind of stuff's really funny. And that brings me very nicely here to Hillary Clinton. Hillary Clinton posted this moments ago. Reminder. Hillary Clinton posted on X. Reminder. Donald Trump staring into the eclipse. <laughs> Again, this is really funny. We live in a country where people regularly have to be told not to shoot at hurricanes with their guns to stop the hurricanes from hitting Florida or Texas. OK, we just we live in a badass country and so we don't like the rule. We don't like rules in America and we don't like the rules applying to us. And Donald Trump just sort of emblematic of that. But Hillary Clinton trolling Donald Trump, uh, quote, tweeting herself, please don't take medical advice from man who looked directly into the solar eclipse. OK, so you'll be shocked to know that this has one response. Why does it have one response? Because Hillary Clinton locked her mentions. These people have such thin skin. I mean, it's thinner than the alleged noose in Jeffrey Epstein's cell where Jeffrey Epstein allegedly hung himself. They won't even allow people to comment. Now, luckily on X, there is a function where you can quote tweet. So you can technically still comment by quote tweeting Hillary Clinton's post here. Heck yeah, says Jack Posobiec. Reminder, you're still not president. Uh, happy birthday to this future president. This is a real, this is a real tweet, by the way. <laughs> Reminder, Donald Trump beat you by 80 electoral votes. Yeah, good time. Good reminder. Reminder, beef. This is Hillary Clinton falling 
into her meat locker van. Why does she drive in a van like this? What do they have in the back there? I would love to get a tour. What exactly is? Why was she thrown into a van like a slab of beef? And again, if you look very closely at this moment, you'll notice that Hillary Clinton is so out of it that her shoes fall off. She gets dragged into the van. Look at that. Meanwhile, Bill Clinton is looking at the sun. <laughs> Staring at the sun is dumb, but not as bad as skipping Wisconsin. Ooh, <laughs> hit her where it hurts. Who can reply? Only people that Hillary Clinton follows. Mm. Yes. Our brave leaders here, ladies and gentlemen. Who can reply? So there's been no replies. Yeah. Got it. Please do not take political advice from somebody who congratulated herself on becoming the president on her birthday just before she lost and was eliminated from politics forever. <laughs> Reminder. We said of Bill Clinton in a dress. Yes. Reminder, Jeffrey Epstein's access to the Clinton White House laid bare. Visitor logs reveal pedophile visited the former White House 17 times, including a dozen in 1994 and twice in one day. Three separate occasions. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Just an important reminder for Hillary Clinton. And Donald Trump's staring at all these replies, right? So it kind of works out perfectly on the platform. Donald Trump's looking right up at the replies. Reminder, Hillary Clinton falling, falling down the stairs in Indonesia. I think it was Indonesia. We actually have the uh, clip of this. It's really, really funny. It, it actually literally makes Joe Biden look like a deeply stable person. Here you go. So, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we've uh, hmm, we've and it, it's re it's really great how this looks. So it's Donald Trump actually looking up at Hillary Clinton falling down the stairs. How embarrassing. Uh, we've told you we would play Donald Trump's great meme of the day for the eclipse. We think this is hilarious. Enjoy. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, to sign us off, one of our favorite Donald Trump impersonators, our favorite, but we'll just say our favorite Donald Trump impersonator, Captain Deplorable is his name, uh, giving a Donald Trump rendition of the eclipse. Will we see Donald Trump during the eclipse today? I'm not sure. It hasn't happened yet, but we'll find out. Here we go. Happy Chris Christie is back. He is hungry and he is crossing a complete and total solar eclipse. He's back and he's crossing in front of the sun. Usually the moon causes eclipses, but today an entire planet is crossing in front of the sun known as Sloppy Chris Christie. I call him a gas giant. He's a gas giant, and he's going to leave a shadow bigger than anybody's ever seen before. Right behind him is going to be huge. Remember, if you're watching the eclipse, only to observe Sloppy Chris Christie if you're wearing your beautiful glasses. It's not safe to look at Sloppy Chris without your glasses, it can cause permanent damage. He says, I call them rough on the eyes, very rough on the eyes. And don't get too close because he's known to have what's called a gravitational pull. 
I saw it happen once. Somebody threw a tomato at him, and it's still going around in his orbit today. Last week, we saw a groundbreaking performance in New York City. Lizzo caused an earthquake, and today we're watching sloppy Chris Christie cause a total eclipse. So be safe. God bless you, and God bless America, believe so, me. So good. So good, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy your eclipse day. It's your boy, Benny. Like, share, and subscribe, and help us eclipse our leftist competition on this platform with truth.